Now you want to place your right hand in front of your chest, the left hand on the back of your right hand. Use your inhalation to raise your arms up. Use your exhalation to open up, release, and surround your body with life force, surround your body with energy. You're creating a halo or an aura of energy around your body that's emanating from your palms and surrounding your entire body. Breathe in, breathe out, and relax the arms next to your body. Empty your shoulders, okay? So let's relax, let's release the shoulders, the elbows, the wrists, and the fingers. Okay? Now, our next pose, or our next series, so this is like a basic um, sequence that you can go through, a flow sequence. So next we're gonna go into Ma'at Ka. The word Ma'at means universal balance, harmony, justice, reciprocity. It means order. So Ma'at, spelled M-A-A-T, means that within the universe is a certain order. And the more we can place ourselves in harmony with that universal order, the better outcomes that we have with our life. So we want to put our ka, which means spirit, in harmony and in balance with that universal order. So by our ka, that's what it represents. So it's, a sim so, so it's very similar. It's like a combination of yoga and tai chi or qigong because you're moving energy, you're using your breath, and you open up the energy centers in your body. So we're gonna start off stepping back towards the back part of your mat. We're gonna bring the feet together, and we're going to um, put the toes together and the heels slightly separated. What I would like for you to do is to put your thumbs on top of your fists. It's a very light fist, so pretend like you're holding a butterfly in your fist. Your hands are gonna come down, your arms down next to your body. You're gonna lift your chest, and you're gonna lower your shoulders and let your weight sink down to the bottom of your feet. Sift your weight into your right foot, and as you inhale, lift your left foot up. As you exhale, extend your heel. But that thigh muscle working, right? Heel comes to the floor. Adjust your feet. Find your balance. And then open up your hands. Back to kinetic palms. Rotate your arms from the shoulders. Breathe in and lift the arms up. Breathe out and put the hands together. Breathe in and lift the head up. Breathe out and release the neck and let your hair go back. Breathe in and bring your head up straight. Exhale and bend forward, shifting your hips back, touching your fingertips to the floor. Breathe in and come up, keep your head in between your arms. As you come up, flat back. Exhale your head back, release your neck and shoulders. Inhale and bring your head up straight. Back of your hands come together. Now exhale, make a straight line from fingertip to fingertip. Now breathe in, as you exhale, turn to your right. Turn your palms out in the same direction as your heart is facing, and then bend your arms at the elbows, making right angles as you exhale. This is your car position. This is the hieroglyphic form for, for spirit. Breathe in. Exhale and turn the head and look towards your left shoulder. Inhale, bring chin over the chest. Exhale, look to your right. Line up chin with chest. Inhale and turn the body to the front. Now slowly exhale, palms together. Once you bring your hands here, I want you to lift up onto the heel of your left foot. Your back leg, you have to bend the knee and shift your hips back like you're sitting down. 
And then as you exhale, keep going down. And then touch your fingers to your big toe. Relax your neck, relax your shoulders. You're going to bring your hands up a few inches away from your foot. And as you inhale, you rise up. Keep your shoulders relaxed. Both your feet come flat, both your legs come straight. Both feet flat on the floor. Now breathe in and lift the arms up. Return to Tekken pose. Exhale the head back. Inhale the head up. Back of your hands come together. Now exhale, make a straight line from fingertip to fingertip. Breathe in. As you exhale, shift your hips back. Put your body parallel to the floor. Breathe in, and then exhale and rotate so that your left hand goes to the inside of your left foot and locks. Turn and look up at your right hand. Open up your spine, open up your shoulders. From here, you breathe in and turn your body back parallel to the floor. Exhale. Now inhale yourself up. As you exhale, bend the arms at the elbows, making car position. Now breathe in. As you exhale, bring the palms together. Use your mind to imagine a ball of energy that you're compressing, getting smaller and smaller between your palms. As you breathe in, your arms go up, reaching up to your ribs and your shoulders. As you exhale, your head goes back. Inhale your head up straight. Bring the back of your hands together. Exhale out. Breathe in. Exhale the arms down. Make fists with your hands. Bend in your left knee. Now transfer your weight from your right foot into your left foot. Your right foot is free. You bring your right knee up. And as you exhale, you point your right heel, lower your foot down, and adjust your feet until you find your balance. <sighs> Open up your hands, both feet flat on the floor. Your feet have to be sufficient this is apart. Rotate your arms out to the side. Use your inhalation to lift. Use your exhalation to bring your hands together. Use your inhalation to lift your head up. Use your exhalation to release your neck. Use your inhalation to bring your head up straight. Use your exhalation to shift your hips back and bend forward, reaching out, touching your fingertips to the floor. Breathe in and rise. Breathe out, let your head go back, release your neck. Breathe in and bring your head up straight. Back of your hands come together and exhale. From here, I want you to breathe in and I want you to exhale and turn out to your left. Turn your palms out. Bend your arms at the elbows. Breathe in. Exhale and turn. Look towards your right shoulder. Inhale, chin over the chest. Exhale, look to your left. Line up chin with the chest again. Inhale and turn body to the front. Now exhale. Palms together. Compress the energy in between your palms. From here you come up on your right heel. You shift your hips back. And you slowly exhale. You bend from the waist. And then lower your hands and touch your big toe with your fingers. Move your hand up, away from your foot towards, towards your chest. Now move from your waist and rise. Don't hunch your shoulders. Just move from your waist. Both feet flat, arms in front of the chest. Use your inhalation to lift your arms. Use your exhalation to let your head go back. Inhale your head up straight. Back of your hands come together. Exhale out. Breathe in. Shift your hips back and exhale forward. Breathe in. Exhale and turn. Right hand in the inside. Lock it in. 
back of your hand to the inside of your foot and then turn and look up at your left hand. Twist your spine, open up your neck. Now inhale and turn your body parallel to the floor. Exhale. Inhale up. Exhale and bend the elbows. Breathe in. Exhale the hands together. Inhale the arms up. Exhale the head back. Inhale the head up straight. Back of your hands come together. Exhale out. Exhale down. Now make your comedic fist. Bend your right knee. Transfer your weight from your left foot into your right. Inhale and lift the left knee. Exhale your left foot down next to your right foot. Now breathe in. Breathe out and relax. And empty your shoulders. Okay? So that's, that's called my Aika. You want to do that pose with left foot going forward first, with right foot going forward second. So once you, do a, once you do left leg and then right leg, that's one time, okay? Whatever you do on one side of the body, you have to do the same thing on the opposite side of the body in order to keep the body balanced, okay? So let's start off again. We're gonna repeat this one more time. 